Master Cheeks was murdered. He gave the world his cake on a paramount platter, and yet it wasn't enough. Where once his beautiful colon cushions might have been on the cover of Covenant Eyes magazine, now they lay cold and atrophied with only the hope from the people that they might hear just one last whisper from the toothless Sarlacc pit resting between those batter balloons. As a salute to the fallen, brown-owned bakery we may never edge to again, I guess it goes to show. You can have your cake, but not your salad toss, too. Wait, who's this? Christopher Nolan, the man who turned the father of the atomic bomb into the detonator daddy. The man who took the plot of this movie and confused the world with this movie. To one-up my confusion therapy with this beautiful ebony action ayahuasca trip, Jaquan Bond 00711, the reverse-averse. As he single-handedly made the world question if it was gay to poop in reverse, while every IPA drinker wrote fan fiction and convinced themselves they understood the movie. The man who wanted to make Matthew McConaughey a meme and Hans Zimmer a music video, so he made this masterpiece. Also, he could be dubbed Chris the Meme God. Cause somehow he knew the world would need a new one. The man who took Qui-Gon Jinn to a black barber, gave Batman a lisp, Heath Ledger an Oscar, and Tom Hardy steroid shoulders. The man who turned those ingredients into a tricycle I would ride till my prostate felt like a Glock in my butt. So why Chris? There's a rumor. Apparently he wants the rights to the cheeked up Power Ranger according to this. So if you don't know, the Halo show was cancelled. So it's a good day to be an affiliated gentleman. Next is Rings of Power. But we'll get there. To be honest, I watched both and enjoyed them the same way I watched Street Fights on Twitter. They definitely should take this down, but hell, it's too gross not to watch. I know there are good people who work on these shows and they work hard. And they don't deserve to be punished for the mistakes of these executives with weird agendas and millions to wank off to in their eyes wide shut secret Santa parties. But, in the great words of Nicole Bach. A little later doesn't want me. It is better to let go, because having six seasons of this would only freak the sheets up of the fan fiction. Wait, maybe we made a mistake. Look, nobody can redo the shart smoothie that is the first season. Because once you start it, you gotta let the ship sink. The people spoke and the fat lady ate her hot pocket. Because according to this article, our boy Chrissy is scheming to take Master Cheeks and beef the boy's cake up with makeup and take it to the big screen. So apparently he's interested, which is a rumor about as concrete as a driveway in Afghanistan. And there really isn't a lot of beef in the article, but it does talk about how Chrissy Baby could and would do the franchise a good service. I'm not really the lore Nazi, but the man made everyone take Batman serious, so I think he's fine. Now, if you haven't seen already, Peter Jackson tried to do the same thing in the early 2000s, and I made an in-depth video, so check that out if you like thick men and halo things. But basically, it was supposed to be on the big screen with Sturdy King Pete, then was supposed to be a show by Spielberg, and then what we got from Paramount is how it ended. So everything should be taken with a grain of an eight ball, just like your nephew's Little League game. Chris's brother just did the Fallout series and was a hit, which I also did a video on, shameless plug number two. But could you imagine the brothers having two high-profile video game series franchises and absolutely smashing both cinema and streaming at the same time? God, take me to the morgue. Check my wiener first. A pulse. It's so stiff I could be a bouncer at a club with no arms. Just dual wielding Bethany Hamilton. Add the third leg with no kneecap. You ain't getting into that club, brother. Could you imagine a cinematic experience with Halo, where Nolan does his crazy dark shots, with Hans Zimmer playing the Halo theme, and the flood poop in reverse? What? I'm down to crown the King Chrissy. That is, if he delivers. But anyway, let me know what you think in the comments. This one's kind of short today, but I thought it was a fun topic, and I'll have some longer, in-depth videos coming soon.